Hey YouTube family, let me show you how to make fried garlic butter chicken tenders. We're going to toss in a teaspoon of salt. A teaspoon of black pepper. I want you to add a half a tablespoon of paprika. Add about a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. I want you to add a half a tablespoon of this chili pepper, parsley, and garlic seasoning. I got this from Ross. You know Ross is the boss. Now add a half a tablespoon of kicking chicken finger licking seasoning. I got this from Ross. Yes, Ross is the boss. Now add about one to two tablespoons of hot sauce, your favorite. Now I want you to go ahead and give this a good mix. But remember this, I never use measurements in my ingredients. So if you feel as if you didn't add enough, go ahead and add to your liking. Remember, let the ancestors guide you. Now I want you to get you a separate bowl and I want you to add at least round about a good two cups of all purpose flour. We're gonna go ahead and season this flour up. So I'm adding here some paprika along with some salt and I'm also tossing in some cayenne pepper. And I'm also gonna give you a little hint of this here kicking chicken finger licking. And I want you to go ahead and just start mixing everything up well. After that, toss in all your chicken tenders and cover them well with the flour. So, in that same bowl that I used up to season that chicken with, I'm gonna add two cracked eggs to this, minus the shell, of course. Then I'm gonna toss in some hot sauce. Then I'm gonna give these eggs a nice beat down, okay? Once that's done, I want you to go ahead and take your chicken, dust it off pretty good, and place it in the egg mixture. Now I want you to go ahead and take your chicken tenders, toss them into that flour, and give them a nice press. Shake off some of the excess flour, set them to the side, and repeat the same steps.
Now I have some hot oil on the stove and I'm using a deep pot halfway filled and my temperature is set at 350 degrees. When your temperature hit 350 degrees, go ahead and toss in your chicken tenders. I place four in this at a time so that they will cook quickly. So do the same process as well. Let's go y'all, don't go nowhere. You just might miss a good recipe, so stay tuned. I took out the first batch. The only thing I want to do is get that temperature back at 350 degrees before I drop in the second batch. It'll cook better that way. So in another pot, I got some of that homemade garlic butter, y'all, and I tossed in some honey with that. All right. I'm telling you something. I made a lot of this here garlic butter and I'm putting this baby to use. I'm not just going to let it sit in the fridge and not use it. So I did toss in some honey with this because this is what I'm going to dip this crispy fried chicken tenders in. So I'm going to take a bowl, toss in my chicken tenders. Along with that, I'm just going to smother these babies with that garlic butter, honey garlic butter. Yes, Lord. And I'm telling you right now, y'all, it might not look good, but my taste bud said, mmm, thank you, sir. Because you gave me something to taste and it was definitely good, y'all. It was beautiful. Yes, sir. Try this here recipe, y'all. But don't go nowhere. We ain't done. You're going to miss a good thing. Stay tuned. I just had to pair these babies up with some of this here dipping sauce, this Chipotle Ranch. I love this stuff, y'all. It's good, I'm telling you right now. So try this here recipe. I guarantee you're gonna like it. But do me a favor if y'all don't mind. Give this video a thumbs up. Share this video. Try this recipe. How do you fix your chicken tenders? Share your recipe with me so I can try it. And if I like doing your recipe, I'll go ahead and make a video and give you a huge shout out. Alright? So share your recipe with me. And I want to thank you guys so much for checking out this video, y'all. These babies was tasty. But do me a favor. Love and not hate. Love somebody. And hate nobody. But before you leave, I want you to give this baby a thumbs up. Share this video with your family and friends. Aha. I gotta go. God, these things are calling me. Peace, y'all. Love and not hate.